about three to four months before the female has a calf, she pushes her other calf away. So then Mohan would naturally be separated from her. So but that's, that's, a, that's the natural thing that happens out in the wild. So three to four months out, they push the other calf away. They have the newborn calf. That newborn calf stays with her um, for about a couple of years. Um, she gets rebred, same thing, then about three, four months out, pushes the other calf away. So it's, like I said, these guys are solitary as well. Um, so they would just naturally leave mom. And sometimes the youngsters would kind of meet up and you kind of have a group of youngsters around um, until they become breeding age. So where does Mohan go? Um, all depends. So he does not have a placement now. Um, yeah. So same thing as with black rhinos. We work with a species, species survival plan. Um, so once again, we judge of who, one who has space to hold an extra rhino who has breeding recommendations. So he's obviously not going to have a breeding rec recommendation for another about, you know, six to eight years. Right. Um, so um, he'll be with us for a little bit longer. So he can still stay here even though she's going to have she's another, gonna have another calf. calf. 